Hey everyone, I have another Christmas nail design to share with you. I started these nails by removing the color I checked for lifting. I did all my prep work and I added primer and then I put a base layer, a thin base layer, a fusion base on her nails cured for 60 seconds. Now you can see me just taking Fusion 2.5 and applying not such a thick layer of base just very fine so that when I file the next time I am not getting down to the natural nail because I'm going to be applying a light elegance glitter gel which is thicker on these ones so you'll see me doing that carrying for 60 seconds and OMG is the light elegance glitter gel I'll be using so pretty and I'm going to apply that at the base of the nail and I'm going to kind of ombre it and pull it down but before I cure it, I'm going to take some loose glitter, a chunkier loose glitter to add to it to ombre it a little more. So this is the really pretty loose uh, chunky glitter I'll be adding. I chose it because of the blue and kind of rose gold in it. It's so pretty. I will try my best to find the link for it. I think I bought it off AliExpress. But anyways, I'll have it down in the description if I'm able to find the link. So I'm just going to apply it to that Light Elegance glitter gel. And once I get it ombre to where I'm happy and the amount added, I'll cure for 30 seconds. So now moving on to the next nail, I'm going to do this nail and the thumb the same as the pinky. So I will just let you guys watch me do that. So the two nails that I didn't do in the glitter, I'm going to build up. They just have the base layer. Now I'm using my Fusion 2.5 and I'm going to build up the nail because I'll be filing after this. But I do have to cover up those glitter nails as well because I kind of did the sandwich technique with them because it is a thicker glitter gel. So I'm going to do each nail cure for five seconds and then once I get them all done, it'll be 60 seconds. So again, I will let you guys watch me do that.
So now that the builder was added to all the nails, I'm just taking some isopropyl alcohol to clean them off. Then I'm going to be taking my 100-180 grit file and I'll file them all to finish file them. And once I get the filing done, I'll take my buffing block to smooth them over. And then we'll be adding color to the ring finger and the middle finger, which we haven't done anything to yet. Okay, so I wiped them off with isopropyl alcohol. Now I'm taking this beautiful blue color. I hate to say it guys, but I don't have a link for it anymore. It looks like it was discontinued. So anyways, I'm gonna apply it. It's such a rich, pretty color, and I wanted it to match the blue in that loose glitter that I put on her nails. So we're gonna apply that here for 30 seconds, and I really don't need a second coat of this, but I will probably go over them once after I get the two nails done, and it'll cure for 30 seconds again then. So on the two blue nails, I'm taking my No Wipe Madam Glam top coat. And the reason is, is I'm gonna be stamping these nails. And because it's such a rich blue color, I find sometimes when I wipe it to stamp, the isopropyl alcohol will just kind of take a little bit of that deep blue color away. So this way it prevents that. So if I have to wipe off the stamp and redo it, it's not gonna wreck the color. So I'll do that and it'll cure for 60 seconds. Okay, so now I'm taking this Beauty Big Bang stamping plate. It's a Christmas stamping plate, and I'll have that link down in the description as well. And we're going to stamp this nail with the snowflakes with a gold. It's just a gold uh, nail polish, and I'll show you on both hands. So now I'm going to take the same gold nail polish and she just wants a snowflake at the base by the cuticle. So we're going to stamp that on both nails. 
So I see I transferred some of the other stamp. So I'm just gonna take some acetone and just remove that. So the two blue nails she wants to be matte, so we're going to take a matte top coat and I'll put it on those two nails, cure for 60 seconds. I don't show it in the video, but I will go over them twice because of it. it's a stamp, so I'll cure another 60 seconds once I get the two layers on these two nails. So I'm just taking some isopropyl alcohol and some acetone to remove the stamp on her skin so that she can see what the matte looks like. And then we're going to be taking my Madame Glam No Wipe Top Coat and shining the glitter nails back up. It'll cure for 60 seconds once I get that done. I'd have to say these probably were one of my favorite Christmas nails I did this Christmas season. And I have to say because of the beautiful deep blue color and I love the, how the glitter turned out with it and the gold, they were absolutely stunning. I don't know if the picture is doing it justice, but thanks everybody for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye. Merry Christmas.